Fuck, restart it, bro. Restart it. <laughs> alright, alright. I can't answer that. I can't answer that. Oh, crap. Um. Oh, God. Uh. <laughs> um. Okay, that's not the question I thought. Um. Alright, all right, hold on, hold on. I gotta think. when you're really passionate about something. Uh, to me, love is the desire for the good of another person. Okay. To me, that's what it is. An undescribable feeling that should be experienced firsthand. It's not some sentimental feeling. It's when you want or are even willing to sacrifice um, uh, for the benefit and for the good of another person. So personally, in my experience, I'm a religious person. So I would say that love is God because in the Bible, it actually states that love, that God is love. And personally, I think that love would mean sometimes it can be painful. Sometimes you have to make sacrifices. Or sometimes it can hurt you or someone else. But as long as you're doing it with the right intentions and doing it for their good, I think that that shows love. And honestly, even if sometimes you don't want to, sometimes you have to bring it out because it might just be bottled up inside and it might be something that you're trying to release. So love, I think, is someone's feelings and their thoughts of well-being towards another person that they would want to show through various actions. Oh, love is something that <laughs> it over like it over what do you call it, it what is love that's my initial reaction to that question love is the mutual feeling between two individuals um that make each other happy and they care for one another Love is when two people are very fond of each other and would do anything to make each other happy. Like, make something that's like really rough and like imperfect so like good to you, I guess. Yeah. <laughs> Love is when your heart is a flutter. You see the person walking across the room and your heart goes into your stomach. <laughs> I think it's where you care about someone and you want to see them reach you know, their own personal potential, what you think they can do in life. And they, they don't even have to care about you back, but it's, it's what you feel about someone else. Yeah. I think it's when you really care about somebody and you do anything and you give your life for somebody. And your stomach acid melts your heart and shoots it straight back up. And sometimes people don't know how to properly show it. So it might be, it might seem violent or abusive, but it's just that they don't know how to properly show the love, or maybe it's not true love. But true love I think is pure, and I think that it's meant to be shown between two people and more people. So then you can see how they want to help each other get the well-being of other people through stuff that they do in life. That's what I think love is. And then you're just like, and then your brain goes into your heart where your heart was and your body starts to switch place and then you just go numb. Love conquers all? I don't know. I don't. All I know is my mom loves me and my dad loves me and I love them. <laughs> yeah. Um, love is wanting to do everything you can for the thing that you love and even giving of yourself and sacrificing for the thing that you love, for the person. 
love. Oh, love is family. It's it's your life. It's what you want to achieve in life. Love, hopefully, is your what you do, the way you act, your job. Yeah. I can't tell you. It's everything. Yeah, that's about it. You gotta experience it to actually know what it is before you give a definition. Be yeah. like death. Like that. That is love. <laughs> okay.